Hi everyone, my name is Dominique Shelton Leipzig. I am a partner in the Cybersecurity and Data Privacy Group of Mayor Brown, which is a global law firm. I do lead the firm's global data innovation team that's responsible for advising C-level and boards on cybersecurity and privacy. And guess what? Today we're gonna to talk about cybersecurity. Cybersecurity is all of the steps that we take to protect cyberspace from cyber attacks. That means technologies, infrastructure, governance to protect our internet. Cybersecurity is so important because it actually is impacting our whole global economy. Last year, cyber events cost our global economy $6.1 trillion. In other words, if cybersecurity were a country and the losses incurred were actually GDP, it would be the third largest country in the globe, right behind the US and China. So that is how important this issue is. There are a lot of tools available to protect individuals and businesses, but it starts first with intentionality. We have regulators recommending that companies adopt a six-step approach to protect cybersecurity. That means having someone that is in charge of the cyber and privacy obligations within the company, knowing what data is being collected and where it's being stored. Also, taking special efforts to have risk assessments that fold in the laws that are impacting your company. And I just wanna say there are over 160 countries that have data protection laws around the world. So uh, understanding where you're doing business and what is expected from you uh, on a regulatory basis is very important for boards. And then for high risk processing, uh, companies are expected to take extra steps to protect things like financial data, health data, children's data, race and sexual orientation, religion and politics. And then finally, having a, an approach for internal governance, external accuracy in terms of how you're communicating your strengths in cyber, and then also having vendor management and training. And then just keeping an auditable record, just like any other enterprise-wide business risk. The increase of automation and AI are really impacting the cyber and privacy landscape. Listen, just this year in 2022, we had almost $400 billion spent by companies on artificial intelligence. Fortune Insights just came out with an article that by 2029, we're expecting that to be over 1.4 trillion. So this is a growing area, it is the future, and as companies continue to stay competitive with their digital innovation, AI is gonna be right front and center. Post-data world, I refer to that in my book, Transform, is it imagines what we are living today, which is a complete reorganization and restructuring of companies so that data is their primary asset. And so while data does not appear on the balance sheet of a, uh, an organization uh, on a quarterly basis, goodwill, if there is M&A, does. And so it's very important to think of this in terms of trust, brand value uh, when you're thinking about these innovations. What the future holds for cybersecurity is an increased melding of cyber data, privacy, and other issues like algorithmic bias or fairness to be part and parcel of a company's digital DNA and their core brand values for trust and integrity. So this is a, a critical issue uh, that companies are gonna be facing and tackling together. Also, I will mention that cybersecurity is not just one thing. It's not just technical. Uh, we've got judges and regulators and uh, all kinds of stakeholders, uh, ESG now, puts privacy and cyber in the governance prong, according to a number of proxy advisors like ISS. So this is really a wide sweeping issue and uh, so exciting to tackle this at the leadership level. What no one else will tell you yet is that cybersecurity is a team sport. It involves a holistic approach, including leadership like the CEOs and boards, as well as legal, HR, communications, and others to be able to tackle this issue. 
It's also very important to quantify risk and get a sense and a handle from the highest levels of an organization to understand what cyber might mean to your business. At my law firm at Mayor Brown, for example, our uh, global data innovation team that's part of our cybersecurity and data privacy group provides C-level and board advice by bringing a constellation of experts together. It's lawyers, it's analytic folks that can quantify risk for the board, and then it also involves communications experts, proxy advisors to be able to know what to say out in the public for publicly traded companies, and really providing that support that is more and more being called for by the SEC, the New York Department of Financial Services, the FTC, and then we're also seeing global trends towards board and CEO accountability in the EU.